Hey, so this is how I made my tick watch run way better and not lose battery life as fast. This is how I really just improved the Tick Watch Pro's battery life. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is enable developer options. So to do that, you're gonna need to unlock the watch if you have a lock pattern on there. And then you're gonna wanna head into the settings you're gonna want to scroll down to you see system, scroll down to about, and then scroll down till you get to build number, and then tap that seven times, and then it'll basically enable developer mode. Swipe back until you get to the uh, front page of the settings, scroll all the way down till you see developer options, and then enable ADB debugging. Then, the next thing you're going to want to do is take your tick watch, plug it right into the computer. I would unlock it for the step also. So just take it, slide the pattern. You don't need to move the tick watch at this point. Plug it into your computer. And then what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna, if you're on Mac, this will be a tiny bit easier. Just open up terminal. If you're on Windows, you're gonna need to navigate to the folder where you installed ADB and you're gonna to wanna to hold shift, right click, and either it'll say open PowerShell window or it'll say open command prompt here, and then you're gonna to wanna to type in, and then you're just gonna to wanna to do these simple steps. Okay, now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open terminal. So just do command space terminal, Again, for Windows, open up the folder where ADB was installed, press the uh, shift and right click button. Either it'll say open PowerShell window or it'll, or it'll say open, open command prompt here. And then what you're gonna wanna do is type in the words ADB devices. You're going to see what is detached. And if it shows um, unauthorized, go back to your watch put in the watch code and make sure that you click always allow for this computer to get your ADB debugging that you enabled. And then the next thing, by the way, both codes will be listed down below in the description. Next thing you're gonna to wanna to do is type in ADB space shell space PM space disable dash user space dash dash user space zero space com dot mob void dot where dot system dot aw. Now what this will do is this will eliminate one of the Tick Watch system apps. And if I'm going into my apps and notifications, I go to app info, I click system apps. Let's go Tick Watch, Tick System. Now Tick System is disabled. Now you can enable it at any time if you have any issues, but person who posted this on Reddit didn't have any issues. What you're doing when you disable Tick System is you're just disabling some of the Tick Watch stuff that happens, like some of the, um, like when you start charging the device, that animation pops up, no more. Anyway, I don't understand why they actually do that sometimes, you don't actually need the animation. Uh, always on display works. It's charging a bit faster than it did before. If you found anything new, Comment it down below. And then all you, what you need to do though is once you're done with this, you're gonna press, when you type it in or you pasted it, just press enter. Package, comma, beware, system AW, new status, disabled, dash, user. Now what that just allows it to do is sometimes you're unable to disable stuff directly from the settings app, even on your phone, you're unable, <coughs> unable to sometimes disable stuff. And what this will do is it'll force disable it. Nothing wrong with the system. It runs extremely well. It runs faster now. It runs well, it runs faster. I just like it as a whole. I think it's great. I'm loving it. 
It improved battery life tenfold. I'm ending with tw with 80% battery life at the end of the day instead of like 50% or even 40%. And then the next day, halfway through the day, it's just gone. It's, it's working perfectly now. So if you did like this video, definitely please rate, comment, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and as always, enjoy the rest of your day.